Boy, temperatures are going to rise quickly for our President's Day. 48 degrees by noon, 53 degrees by 4 o'clock. So if you happen to have the day off work for President's Day, get outside and enjoy it. It is going to be a very nice day. 55 degrees to forecast high in the capital city. That's above the average high of 42 degrees. A mixture of sun and clouds. Uh, winds initially out of the southwest, transitioning out of the west by late afternoon, anywhere from 7 to 15 miles per hour. We can see a few high clouds drifting in overhead on satellite imagery. There are more off to the west. They're a little bit thicker to the west, but as they move into eastern Nebraska, they start to thin out just a little bit. Uh, these are being uh, forced by the terrain out west and then they fizzle out by the time they get to eastern Nebraska. Kind of seeing a similar picture today. Just a few waves of high clouds at times. That is about it. I have seen some versions of Stormcast even suggest maybe a couple of isolated showers trying to develop in northern Nebraska, maybe sneaking into south central or southeast Nebraska later on tonight. I think these will be the exception as opposed to the rule. Most of us getting through today and tonight on a completely dry note. That may change heading into Wednesday though. We have winter storm watches in effect for much of northern Nebraska, even winter storm warnings in effect for portions of the panhandle. That's those pink shaded counties. These shaded regions you see right now, that's where you have the best chance of seeing snow Tuesday night into Wednesday. Stormcast 3 a.m. Wednesday, you can see some of that snowfall. It mostly remains off to the north. What I think may be an issue in southeast Nebraska is ice, maybe seeing some freezing rain development. I will say as well, this is a prime position for a dry slot to move in overhead, so that might be our saving grace in terms of ice accrual in southeast Nebraska. But nevertheless, a mix will be possible and temperatures will certainly drop 36 degrees on Wednesday after two days in the 50s and then 18 degrees for a high on Thursday. So it's going to get a lot chillier to close out the work week. Starting to warm back up on Friday, though, a high near 27 degrees, maybe a small chance to see some light snow. And then for the weekend, right back up into the 40s and 50s. This weekend also not looking too bad.